Mr. Speaker, you have a quorum. Senate, come to order. Mr. Sergeant Orange, invite the members in and close the door. Our minister today is the Reverend Larry Young, the guest of Senator Woodson. Will the members please stand? Guests in the gallery, please stand. And remain standing through the Pledge of Allegiance led by Senator Woodson. Senator Woodson, you're recognized to introduce our minister of the day. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. It's my great honor to introduce to the chamber and our guest, Reverend Larry Young. He was born in 1948 in Maryville, Tennessee. He is married to his wife, Kay, who is with us today. They have two sons and four grandchildren. He graduated from Everett High School in 1966 and then went to earn his bachelor's degree from Furman University in 1980 and his master's of divinity degree from Southeastern Baptist Theological Seminary in 1983. He's been a pastor since 1978 and has been the pastor of Holston Baptist Church in Strawberry Plains since 1997. I would also like to make a special note, members, that he is also the uncle of our very own Jordan Young. It is my great honor to introduce to you Reverend Larry Young. Young, you're, you're recognized. Thank you for this privilege to be here with you this morning and to lead you to the throne of grace. Let's pray together, shall we? Thank you, Lord, for your blessings this day, for hearing our prayers and giving to us the privilege of being your servants in this world you created. Thank you for these men and women who have given themselves to serve you in the great state of Tennessee. I ask that you lead and guide these senators in their deliberations this day. Remind them of their stewardship of the resources you have bestowed upon this state and its people. In their work today, give them wisdom, insight beyond sight that can only come from you. May they see and do your good and perfect will for their lives and those they represent. Let them know that as they are obedient to you, you will bless them and bless this state through them. Protect them and their families from those who would harm them. Shield each member from those who would try to persuade them and to tempt them to do that which is not right. Help us to remember the love that you extended to us through your only begotten Son, Jesus Christ, the only Savior. Thank you that through him you make hope available to all. Praise you, Father, for our hope from you is not one with a question mark, but rather hope with an exclamation point. Be gracious and merciful to us, O Lord. Forgive us where we fail and strengthen us to the task that await us. At the close of this day, give these senators rest, knowing that they have served to the best of their abilities and in faithfully serving you when this life is over, that they may hear you say to them, well done, good and faithful servant. Bless the state of Tennessee and these we have elected and that you have appointed. We ask all these things in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Senator Woodson. Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Before we go to roll call, I'd like to introduce and uh, recognize Senator Somerville. Senator Somerville, you're recognized. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Our Lord in heaven, it's still a beautiful world. You must still love it very much. But a lot of sorrow has visited on this chamber this year. Some of us lost parents, good friends. Dixon has lost a fine young man, Trooper Andy Wall, the Tennessee Highway Patrol, killed last weekend in the line of duty. His parents, his family, dearly respected and loved by all of my fellow citizens in my hometown. His funeral is today at Lawrence Street Church of Christ. Please put his family, if you would, in your prayers. If you don't mind, we may have a moment of silence here, and I'll allow Senator Somerville to 
close the word of prayer on Trooper Wall, who lost his life in the line of duty this week. Member, will the me members please stand? The guests in the gallery, please stand. We'll go to the Lord in a moment of silence, then I'll recognize Senator Somerville to close. Senator Summer, we are recognized. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. There are no finer people among us than those who wear the badge. They don't know when they leave home if it's a goodbye for the shift or goodbye forever. We can't thank them enough. Trooper Wall made the ultimate sacrifice, but he's in a place where he wouldn't come back if he could because he's dearly loved in your company. We thank you in the name of our Lord and Savior and our brother, Jesus Christ. Amen. Roll call, Mr. Clerk.